Hey guys, it's Dave here. I got some mail today from Mohawk Paper that I'm gonna go through with you. A little unboxing, if you will. But first, I want some cereal. Let's go downstairs. More from Mohawk. Let's see what we got cooking here. Ready for it? Woo wee! Pop, 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 pop. Oh, oh can't, can't show you what that is yet. Here's the big reveal. Oh, oh, I'm just having, I'm just having a peek here. Oh God, it looks so good. Oh, it feels so cool. Okay, it's so much better than I thought it was gonna be. Okay, um, here we go. This is the new product for Mohawk, Mohawk Renewal. This is their new stock with alternative fibers, with cotton fibers, denim fibers, hemp fibers, straw fibers, such a cool paper. Um, let's dive into this swatch book. There it is in all its glory. Look at this thing, guys. This, this is incredible, this paper. This denim fiber blue paper is one of my favorites for sure. Look at this. Can you get like the fleck in there? My gosh. Bring it closer. Come on, camera. Focus, focus, focus. Like, it's just incredible. Look at this thing. The way they got them overlapping in the cover here. Love the assembly. See how it all overlaps and comes together uniquely like that. Very cool. Well done, Mohawk. Let's open this bad boy up. Okay, I love this. Not only is it a great uh, new product, but they use the swatch book to actually tell the story. Tell the sustainability story is just incredible a great opportunity reimagine reuse reclaim recycled cotton paper is made from t-shirt and denim scraps diverted from millions of tons of textile waste sent to landfills that's awesome and they've created such an incredible paper out of it Reimagine hemp stock. Making paper with hemp contributes to the growth of a sustainable supply chain for this rapidly renewable fiber source. Every sheet of Mohawk Renewal hemp is made from 30% hemp fiber. See, what I love about that is there's a couple of other manufacturers that have a hemp paper, but they tell you that the hemp, the sort of like quantity of hemp or the percentage of hemp in each sheet is somewhere between one and 50%, like, that just does not create any sort of consumer confidence in using that as a hemp favor paper and like claiming that it is a hemp based paper. So I love that they've actually put an, uh, an actual number on it, put a stamp on it. 30% of this fiber is hemp. Awesome. And just this paper, just like all Mohawk papers, holds images just beautifully. The photography is great. I love how they use this to tell the story. This is awesome. Beautiful photography telling the story. Raw fibers, raw sheets. The actual plant. Look at that. And that combination of that um, sort of white t-shirt and denim scraps, you know, making a fiber using that creates such a unique color. 
All right, so let's browse this bad boy. Hemp, hemp is up first. Here's the different colors available in hemp. Weights are from 80 pound text up to 140 pound cover. Damn. So this is the 140 pound cover I'm feeling here. This is the fiber white. You can see there's some fleck there. Let's get a little bit closer. You can probably see some of that hemp fleck in that sheet. Which, you know, just sings recyclability, sings eco-friendly. But listen to that. 140 pound, that is beefy. That's so nice. That's gonna hold the emboss and the deboss beautifully. That's such a great one. Look at these other colors in here too. This one is called Flower. I love that. Look, this is such a nice green color and you feel it's got this really nice vellum finish to it. Beautiful texture. Love this paper. Can't wait to do something on it. And in true Mohawk style, oh, the, it's such a clean smell to it. Such a clean smell, not chemically, just such a natural clean smell. Next up, we've got the recycled cotton stocks. Cotton textiles have been recycled to make paper for centuries. Strong yet soft, cotton fiber makes beautiful paper. Both shades of Mohawk Renewal recycled cotton are a direct reflection of their input materials. T-shirt white is pure cotton textile waste, while denim is made from 30% blue denim thread and 70% white cotton t-shirt scraps which creates that beautiful blue color that I'm absolutely in love with. I gotta find a, a, a place for it. Like, let's, let's give you a huge view of it. Like, this is just, look at that color. It's so unique. You get the blue from the denim, obviously, but you also have so much white in there that it doesn't become like a dark blue sheet. It becomes this, this beautiful, soft blue color. I'm, I absolutely love this paper. I gotta use that somewhere. Okay, so let's flip back here and just sort of have a look at some of the weights and stuff about this stock. Okay, so finish on this one is a rough finish. It's, you know, it's described as rough and I guess compared to smooth, yeah, it's a bit rough, but it's, it's still gonna accept images and solids really nicely. Weights, 80 pound text, 60 pound cover, and 120 pound double thick cover. Those cover weights, especially with it being a cotton and uh, sort of textile based paper, is gonna hold an emboss and a deboss beautifully. Like that's gonna be so nice. I wanna just get a feel of this. Double thick cover in the blue, beautiful. Love that. And it just feels so, it feels so good in the hand. Like it's such a unique tactile experience, this paper. Mohawk Renewal, whew, happy days. Okay, straw. Let's get into the straw here. What makes straw special? Straw is a byproduct of wheat farming that is typically disposed of as waste. Every year, thousands of acres of this rapidly renewable fiber are either burned off or plowed under, contributing to carbon emissions and soil erosion. Whew, makes sense, so make a beautiful paper out of it. Why the heck not? Okay, so here is like this natural color that they call harvest white. It's a really kind of antique off-white color. Even though the lighting, it, it looks, it kind of looks green in the lighting around the camera, but it's definitely not. It is um, a, a very antique white. Let's get this little cover sheet out of the way. It's this very um, you know, old school antique white. There's some like straw fleck in there that you can see, which is, uh, has beautiful. Again, it feels like that nice rough finish, um, but it is also available in a smooth finish, what will be smoother than, um, than the rough, obviously. Available in the weights, uh, 80 pound text, 120 pound cover, 140 pound cover, beautiful. The 140 pound cover, guys, I think is my favorite on this one, um, in this entire lineup. Like this, so much beef to that stock. It's gonna, you could slam a deboss into this. Beautiful cover stock for booklets, super classy. Plus you have an environmental story to tell using this Mohawk stock. Here is what they call the wheat finish. It's kind of a, it's a really unique orange, almost like a vintagey uh, sort of orange, vintagey, is that a word? But a vintage uh, orange color. It's really, really nice. That's so nice, it feels so good feels really good in the hand. So guys, this um, this Mohawk Renewal line, the swatch books are out now. Contact your spicers or your local 
uh, paper supplier and get yourself a copy of this swatch book. It's just beautiful. I mean, you get an example of it right on the front cover here. Here is a white foil on that blue uh, denim and cotton scrap uh, stock. And the white foil holds so nicely. Even the fine type here, um, just a beautiful paper. Mohawk guys, makers of beautiful papers, great papers for designers. And now not only that, but there's a massive sustainable story to go along with this particular new line. They've always had recycled papers. They've got the Mohawk Options stock, which is a beautiful uncoated paper. Now with this renewal line, they have a huge variety of offerings. So do not miss out. Find out where you can get this swatch book. Now, members of Print Design Academy will be having a contest to receive this swatch book. If you are not a part of Print Design Academy, but you're a graphic designer wanting to learn more about print, learn how to become an expert in graphic design for print, go to printdesignacademy.com and join the wait list. We're gonna be opening again later in 2020. Uh, right now the doors are closed so you cannot get in, but uh, you don't wanna miss out on contests and things like this. And I cannot wait to put this paper to use with the members within Print Design Academy and in this community. Guys, the Mohawk Renewal Swatch Book it's beautiful. This new line for Mohawk is beautiful. Mohawk has hit it out of the park again. Check it out, guys. Don't miss out on this paper. Cheers.